Hi, and welcome. Uh, this is uh, what I got today. This is my plant hole. Uh, I was, I went to um, plantation, and uh, I got six small plants. I like small plants because I live in a small apartment, and has there's some things that I've bought before like this uh, birds nest fern well it's a fern um, I like ferns and I have one of these growing in one of my terraria um, and yeah so I wanted to have another one to try and maybe even more terraria so, um, and then there's Phytonia, they looks a little, they looks, they look weird, but, uh, uh, they're all alive and seem health, healthy. I think maybe they just got more, uh, light than I have given mine before. So they're very compact. It's like they've been stepped on. <laughs> but... Well, uh, I like this. I really love them. Uh, small plants, n very nice fo foliage, and uh, but I've killed the ones I've had before, either because well, so some uh, dried out uh, during a vacation. Some didn't like it in the terraria I have. Um, I'm not sure what, what exact, uh, exactly they don't like, but they died. So I'm trying one more time. Um, this is also a phytonia. Um, uh, it's got different colors, and I haven't had this variety before. So. Um, so that was probably the boring part, and this, I'm not really sure what it is, because I'm not very into aroids, they're called, so maybe it's a prayer plant, or maybe it's, uh, um, Stenanthus, or... Well, um, it looks nice, and it looks kind of like one I have in the terraria before, but when I got home, I realized they're probably not the same species. Um, uh, yeah. So it will be exciting to see how this one does. I really like, I like the coloring, the, the pattern on the leaves, and... Also, the burgundy uh, undersides. Uh, I haven't had a lot of luck with these kind of plants before. So we'll see. And then there's this. I think it, I'm probably pretty sure it's an alocasia. But what kind, I'm not sure. All these uh, little plants are just uh, marked mixed color. So, um, if anyone can tell me exactly what it is, uh, I'm um, happy. Uh, it will be very exciting to see if I can keep this alive. I had a lot. Uh, full-size version of it or pr something similar uh, before and kill it so um, but I just couldn't resist it and I need some more plants some small plants that fits in small viver vivariums so ah and this one I'm not sure what it is uh, 
I'm suspecting it's what you call a string of pearls. And it looked half dead when I uh, bought it because it was very dry. But I, I know these plants will survive uh, uh, drying out. And it seems like some water really helps. So uh, the big question is if I uh, uh, will be able to not drown it because I tend to water my plants a little too much. So I need to figure out a way that I can can prevent this from that from from being drowned. That's all the small plants, and then really a guilty pleasure because me and look at that me and uh, uh, orchids are not really a good match so uh, but I haven't had this type before and look at that foliage I just love that so and it also has a small baby cake. Cakey, is that what you, you orchid people call it? Well, it had one, and the so, and the beautiful foliage, and a pretty flower. So even but even if it never flowers again, this foliage is worth it. I think. If I just can keep it alive. <clears throat> well, that was the, today's plant haul. So, what do you think?